couple of days ago we were checking our daughter in for her first flight overseas to um, Sydney, Australia. She'd been planning her trip for a few months and um, we got to the airport about two hours before departure time and when we went to check her in at the airport uh, the customs, not the customs guy, the air, um, the air check-in guy uh, said it doesn't seem that she's got her visa registered with her uh, with her ticket and we looked at each other and said you need a visa to go to Australia and we did not know so um, the look of horror and despair on our faces was probably pretty evident my daughter was about to have a nervous mental breakdown um, the agent took great sympathy on my daughter and it would have been very easy for them to say hey you know it's your responsibility to get your paperwork in order before the flight but instead of doing that they really owned responsibility he called his manager over and it was like with military precision that they were trying to help us work through the whole situation so we ended up um, standing there in line with my daughter's laptop getting pulled out of her bag logged on to the Australian visa website, immediately processed the application and got the notification that said your application will be processed within 48 hours. Clearly 48 hours was not going to be very helpful when she was going to be boarding the plane in about an hour. Um, so we were kind of freaking out and my daughter was, you know, proceeding to fall apart a little bit more. <laughs> um, but we, a little bit of waterworks, got a lot of, a lot of upset feelings, it's been a long time in planning the trip. Um, but the gentleman called his manager over and the manager uh, really helped walk us through the process. He had a couple of his ticketing agents trying to check my daughter in every few minutes just to see if the uh, boarding would, would happen, if, um, they would, <laughs> if, they would, if they would be able to process it if something had happened. And uh, he had said he'd only ever seen these, uh, these applications get turned around closest in six hours so we weren't overly hopeful. So. Uh, we started to think about what we could do in terms of getting her there a couple of days later um, and then he found out we had booked our ticket through uh, Expedia and by doing that he wasn't able that to make any changes yeah, yeah we weren't be able to make any changes to the ticket uh, but he sat there and waited while I was on hold with Expedia and he was going to do what he could to help our situation uh, but while we were on hold we heard the ticketing agent say wait did you guys do something we looked over at her looking kind of hopeful and sure enough the uh, application that we did online in the lineup got processed almost immediately and they were able to issue her boarding pass um, and so everybody was really happy for her you could see they were they were thrilled to be able to help her out and i guess we were just really impressed with the fact that it would have been very easy for them to say you know that's not our problem you need to get yourself organized if you're going to be traveling internationally but instead they really took it upon themselves to, to help us out and as a result uh, my daughter is now in Australia safe and sound.